Uh, I am here at the Lady Provincial Jail and at the back are the families of the inmates. Actually, the situation here is different than the usual. Right now, I'm beside one of the female inmates. Please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Miriam. Miriam, uh, briefly describe what happened at the height of the typhoon here in the provincial jail. While we're preparing for the medicines that we'll be distributing to the families, the children, the spouses, and the inmates, and later on the, the, the female inmates, and of course the, the, uh, the male inmates, we just give priority first to these children. I know when they're preparing for the medicines, I would like to hear from you what happened here during the height of the super time. Okay, early in the morning, November 8th, of course, the news, alam na namin, we were prepared na kami doon sa mga typhoon, but during the typhoon at 5 o'clock in the morning, nasa loob lang kami ng aming center, ng detention center. So, malakas ng hangin, lahat na umana, wala na yung roof namin na wala na rin. Dahil sa lakas ng hangin, So you are no longer safe inside the building. Yeah, no okay. Lang. Because we were afraid of the water to get high. Uh -huh. So you you were allowed somehow with a guard to, no, to get out. To get out. Okay. So when you say get out, some some of the prisoners left the, 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 the vicinity of the jail. No, oh, parang ganun na. So, Pero kami kami mga babae kasi malit lang naman kami. Nas takot na kami din lumabas. Diyan lang muna kami until next day. So pinapasan we na kami ng so to find out our our families because we heard the stories na maraming mga patay. So somehow you were not given a little bit of freedom to get out of the jail. Both male and female. Yes, over oh, okay. But it was only a verbal, but uh, uh, And uh, since it happened more than a month ago, are you all the those uh, prisoners are back already in the jail? Oh, so, so 100. How many total there are? 587. So, 100 uh, prisoners are still accountable for this time. But, um, they're going to be back again. Poisonous, I think, for yeah. Well, I will not discuss the specific of the case. It's just nice to know you. And maybe just give us a background of the, these people. Do you have an idea what are the common illnesses of the family members? Uh, Sajan, Sipon, 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 the usual. Uh -huh. Anyway, uh, you gave me a list of uh, female inmates. Uh, so this, uh, what we have right now are already packed medicines uh, for you to iron back infection. I know it's very common for females to have your iron back infections. So probably what we're going to do, even if they don't have your iron back infections right now, we will give them like a a reserve, reserve, reserve uh, medicine that in the future should they have a urinary that you can give them some of the other medicines to use. Other than that, there are also medicines for respiratory tract infections, some reliever, uh, pain relievers, uh, 
our volunteer nurses will also check, I don't know if they are prepared to check up the blood pressure, we have, we have blood pressure kids. So for now, we will, as I've said, we prioritize the children, we, we, we uh, register them one by one, and then we give them whatever they will need, okay? So uh, while, there, while there is an ongoing uh, distribution of other uh, relief goods, I think the IWATS, they are here to distribute uh, items like kumut, uh, uh, blankets, uh, 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 what, what else? Do you have an idea what are those items? Malums po, Malums. So the things that are used in, in inside the, the cells. Yeah. But here, the beautiful heart foundation, what we brought in are medicines that are commonly used. These are donated from the Brothers Brother Foundation and some friends of the beautiful heart foundation in the United States. Okay, so uh, we will have more of this documentation as we start our medical mission. Okay, thank you ma'am for your time and may God bless you. God bless you.